on, Bass Kickers. Let me turn off that flash for you. What is going on, Bass Kickers? It is Bass Kicker here, back with another video. I know it has been a ridiculous amount of time since I have been out with a video, but that is all good. We are back here. It has been going on, like, what, two weeks now? I'm not sure I'll have to check on my timeline on my videos, but here we go. We are back. I was strolling around Walmart, and I, f I was looking at tackle bags because I had 20 bucks, and I was looking for a new tackle bag because my ugly stick one over there wasn't doing so good. And what I found was the Okeechobee Fats tackle bag right here. It's a medium tackle bag. has all Plano boxes in it. I'm going to be reviewing this bag today for you guys because I absolutely love it. We're going to be doing some reviews. Let's start now. Alright guys, so the first thing right off the bat is it had these really, really cool like knife holders and stuff like that right here on the front so you can keep a bunch of stuff there. I think that is absolutely really cool. And then you got these little uh, loops right here so you can hang stuff just like so. Um, some really good stuff there. And then if you go inside the front here... You have a, a Plano box right here where you can keep, like, your hooks or whatever. So, a lot of Plano box storage, definitely. And then on the side pockets, you can keep a bunch of stuff in there. And then, go in here. And surprise, surprise, I got a new scale. So, that's definitely something that's uh, a lot better than the last time. But, on to the main reason why I like this bag all Plano brand boxes Whew, comes with them. Definitely nice. If you guys are going to go get plastic boxes for your um, bag or any plastic box at all, I definitely recommend Plano. And I'm going to tell you why right now. So if I grab this box, which is my crankbaits, I can throw this box on the concrete and it probably would not crack. The, the plastic feels flimsy, but it's really not. And these boxes are just so flexible that you could literally do whatever you want with these boxes, and they will not break. It is so cool. But how I personally like to organize this bag is I keep all my crankbaits in there, uh, my spinners and spoons in there, um, my topwater spinnerbaits and jigs box right there. And then right here I just have some plastics. I can't really get it out because it's stuck, but right in here I just have some plastics. So if you guys are looking for storage, look no further. This bag definitely has it. It has a built-in strap that is adjustable, very strong. It has a really nice, almost holographic finish over it. Um, it has a nice place to where you can keep your stringer, uh, that kind of thing. Works really nice. This is another reason why I like this bag so much. It only weighs like seven and a quarter pounds, where my last one weighed like, what, I don't even know, 15 pounds? And this bag even has all my tackle in it, so very, very light bag. And I, my verdict on this, it's a very nice bag. If you guys really want storage, if you guys want something small, if you're going to be hiking, definitely go with the Okeechobee Fats tackle bag. I will definitely be using this bag in the future. Definitely is my new tackle bag. Overall, definitely nice storage, nice Plano storage, as you guys can see there. Definitely nice as there. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Sorry, I, I just had to do that. But stay on the barb, and I'll catch you guys later.